So I'm done with work. I just wanted to chop it up with y'all for a little bit, man. Hey, man. You know I usually don't drive my car to DC, but yeah, I drove it to uh, drove it to work. So um, don't do that much of That's because I know I want you to do it. Video, man. That's because I do it. Hold on. I think this car is too fast for DC, man. It takes off way too fast. And um, I don't want to try to change because of the potholes and stuff like that. But um, it's just like one time out of the blue, you know? It's not going to do any damage to your car. But uh, the reason why I really want to like this this get y'all because I wanted to drive the thing in the uh, in the tunnel again. I haven't driven in the tunnel in a long time and I miss it. So um, that's what I'm really gonna do. Uh, that's what I want to do. So yeah, y'all stay tuned, bro. I got my uniform on and stuff like that. I'm ready to take this thing off. I'm ready for the freaking weekend. All right, y'all. Hey man, the weekend is here. It's time to go. Hey, one thing I want to do on June 18th, I'm gonna try to go to. The Streets B717 um, was like a little road race thing. I'm not going to be there to race. I'm going to be there to spectate and stuff like that. Uh, also, I got I got something with the 300 Alliance coming up. I'm going to post that on my IG so I can show everybody. So if y'all want to meet me there, we're going to be there, man. I'm going to get out this lane because uh, where the still place at? We got a still place somewhere. I do not want to hit no still place. Uh, this is probably the slowest I ever drove in DC. <laughs> I'm driving underneath the speed limit. I'm not even doing the speed limit. Just because I want to be cautious. That's why I'm moving about the slowest. Yeah. I usually do the speed limit, you know. In DC got too many potholes. So you never want to go faster than the speed limit. So this is a review of driving my 300 in the city. I never drove my 300 in the city with the coilovers. I'm just seeing how it does. It's not really bumpy. Uh, I am dodging all the potholes because I know that if I do hit the potholes, it's just going to be catastrophe. And I ain't trying to hide that, man. But other than that, driving in DC, it's still comfortable. I take, you see it, you see it's bumps here and there because it's just a bumpy road. But that was a that was a little big bump. But it's not bad. Who is that? Oh, who was that? Oh damn! Let me go. Big meanie. You don't get no right. Yeah, I right, know. The people in DC don't care. That's why I don't drive my car in the city like that. Because nobody cares about your car. Everybody's reckless and. Everybody's aggressive, and I don't drive like that in the city, bro. When you got open, you know, open space and stuff like that, you're in a narrow road and you're always next to somebody. Oh, it's super hard. I think I'm able to catch it. I don't know. Am I? I hope I am. I don't even know, bro. Am I too late? Yeah, I think I'm too late. Curb lane colors. Go up some more, and that's what I didn't want to do because I know the road is horrible because they do construction. Yeah, but this giant is really handling really good. Um, in the city, um, I, I drove what a few miles already. Uh, it's just it's really stable, really sturdy. It's actually a little bit more stiffer, so that's what I like about it. But um, oh uh, yeah, I got I got my trip coming up, y'all coming up this week. Oh, I might as well stay in this lane. But I'm not getting behind this old truck. Throwing rocks and stuff, bro. I, that's all. I don't like getting behind those dumpster trucks. They be having fallen asphalt and rocks falling off their car. I ain't got time for that. My car front has already got little chips in the mix. Well, it's not noticeable, but I notice them. That's why I bought a little uh, front bra so I can get that fixed so I don't have to worry about it. You know? So I'm gonna have that on it when I do like long trips and stuff like that. I'm gonna put the front bar on and um, to keep my car from all the trucks and stuff like that. <laughs> Dude, 
What about this gas situation? I see that they fixed it though. Everybody went crazy putting all this stuff and they fixed it. Yeah, I told y'all, y'all need to calm down. Analyze the situation, see what you can do. If you can't do nothing about it, figure out, you just gotta analyze it. You just gotta slow down and think, you know? Y'all was moving too fast. Like, oh no, this and that. Y'all being crazy. Oh, look at this dude, look at this dude. Big stupid. That's why his gas cap is open. Big stupid head dude. On the road, that's why you know you can't drive. You got your gas cap open. Looking tacky. All right, now we in some construction now. Okay. All right. She driving, y'all. She driving good, too. I need to get them real tires. I need new rear tires. That one on my left is like really long. It's not showing any like wire or anything, but I know it's gonna show it soon. But I don't drive this car that much just because unless I'm you know got something, but I've been working, y'all. I've been working super hard trying to get this content out for y'all. It's been really hard, man. Um and then I'll be going back to work full time. Won't have any like too many days off on a week, but I'm, I'm always gonna have some some videos for y'all. I got a lot of things coming up, but I'm always it's gonna be some changes in the Grizzly Marty, you know, like uh, the way I do things. I'm always gonna try to put out a video though. I still got Monday, Wednesday, and Friday the days that I put out videos. That's the days I'm still going to continue to do. Not gonna quit. Um, just have to adjust to some things. Got a transition. I was watching uh, CJ So Cool's thing. He's like, hey, you just got a transition, and that's that's a big YouTuber, man. Um, I watch his YouTube all the time. I like all his pranks and stuff like that, man. Sad what's going on with him, but uh, he, he he's cool. Man. That's somebody I would like to meet too. CJ So Cool, man. He's from well, he's from Gary, Indiana, Indiana. I'm from Louisville, Kentucky. We like right right there, you know. We deal with the same type stuff. driving in DC y'all it is not fun at all bro I, I hope I didn't run over no nails no stuff like that it's all type of stuff bro this is a this is a dingy city that's <laughs> like that's not a dingy city it's actually a pretty city but when they got this construction stuff they just make it look so bad they just tear up the streets and and they do it like during rush hour times it's the most dumbest thing I can ever think about they should do it on at night time or when the sun is going down you know, where people are trying to be home or whatever. Go ahead. I'll see you. I'm, I'm a nice person sometimes. I can let people over. You know, when you get in this driver's seat, sometimes you do be aggressive. I ain't gonna lie. I, I be that way sometimes. Sometimes I ain't like nobody over, you know. But, you know, I, well, I ain't in no rush right now. I'm just chilling. Oh, yeah, my caliber covers. He sent me the uh, tracking number for the caliber covers. Those should be in soon. Uh, so now the hood. Everybody wants me to get the hood. Okay, okay. The hood is coming. Comment down below. What hood you think I'm gonna get? Cause I'm gonna. I'm gonna uh, I, I hope I can surprise y'all or just like change the game. I don't see too many of them, but I see them. And I don't see none here in the USA. You know. I don't see him here. Like I said, I always try to be a little different. It's some things that I like that I see other people do, and I'm, I'm gonna do it, cause I like it. But it's sometimes I, I, I wanna look a little different. You know, I want my car to stick out like a sore thumb. And of course it does, cause it's a 300. When I'm around a whole bunch of charges, my car sticks out. And with the wrap and everything, but when I do, when I get the full wrap, oh, it's really gonna stick out. It's gonna be, it's gonna be crazy, y'all, I'm telling y'all. I'm looking real scruffy right now. I'm about to get my hair cut and everything tomorrow. Don't worry about it. I just had to wait. <laughs> oh, my voice crack a little bit. Had to wait a little bit, but yeah. Bouncing back. I already hit up my barber like, bro, need that cut. Looking a little homeless. <laughs> you know, like you gunning a little bit, like, just take off. 
feel like doing that. Look at this lady on this. Oh, I can't get her. Because this thing is stuck on the suction cup. My GoPro. Grizzly Gang, I just wanted to talk to y'all just a little bit, uh, just update y'all. I know this video is not going to be long, um, just a few things I had on my mind. Uh, just do a little test run in DC. And, uh, I'm going to get some footage actually Sunday. Yeah, so Sunday I'm going to be doing some things. Sunday and Monday. Well, not going to do anything Friday. Well, Saturday I got a busy day. Y'all see on IG, I won't record anything because it's not meant to um, record, but I, I might record it, but I'm not going to put it on my YouTube. Um, everything will be on my IG if you want to know what's going on. Um, so follow my IG, it's just grizzly underscore Marty, alright? My YouTube is grizzly Marty, my IG is grizzly underscore Marty. Alright, so follow me on that if y'all want to see what's going on tomorrow and why I really didn't have any time to to really record you know today and I'm giving y'all this type video So let's get ready. I messed up. Oh, I got. I I went to like put it in neutral. Let's see. Drive this car, bro. You get so many man, uh, engaged. No, I'm gonna take it out. Okay. Um, so when you drive this car, y'all, y'all get so many looks and stuff like that. That's why I love driving this train. Um, I feel like I, I can get like my car really out and people really know my name if I drive it in DC, but I don't want to destroy my car, bro. It's, it's not worth it in, in the long run for me. So, um, I pick up my subscribers and stuff like that the way I do it. Slowly and surely, you know. And all y'all little fake accounts, stop hit me up, man. I don't like that stuff, bro. They like, hey, get this and that, and you can get this many. Don't do that, bro. If you're gonna be fake, I'm totally not that way. If you're gonna do it that way, don't be on YouTube, man. Success is gonna come. You know, I already feel successful with a uh, little bit of people that I have. I feel like there's a lot of people. If you if you if you have a uh, just think about it. I have 3,000 something subscribers. If I have those, that many people in front of me, that's a lot of people staring at me right now. <laughs> so I feel extremely blessed. Shout out to all the Grizzly Gang, y'all. I know this, this, this video is all over the place. No way, you ain't getting me. Speed bump. That thing was like, a, it wasn't a speed bump, my bad. It was like the little sewage thing, but it went down. It was a dip. Like it was like that much wide dip. Like it went down and up. Nah, I'm not hitting that. That's how you mess up your uh, your alignment and your axles and stuff like that. I ain't got time. No way. I ain't got the time or the money to be paying for extra stuff like that. My baby girl coming. And my son needs stuff too. <laughs> He want a VR headset, so yeah. Money's leaving my pockets. That's what happens when you got kids. You got to do stuff for them, y'all. Don't let them be boring. Let them have fun. <laughs> well, I got a tunnel coming up, too.
I had some good tunnel, tunnel action this morning though. But unfortunately, I was not recording. Man, I was just trying to get to work. I was half asleep, just trying to get here. DC is a beautiful place, y'all. If y'all ever in the area, come to DC. It's one of the cleaner cities. That's not all cities are clean. take my phone off the, the dang on suction cup because none of my batteries is charged which sucks all four of my batteries that I got they are on like 2% and this is the only one I had that was on 5% so Grizzly Gang I pretty much see y'all in the next one man I appreciate every single one of y'all man if you're not having a good day hey somebody's thinking about you and that's me man I appreciate every single one of y'all. And I really, uh...